Hi, Noel Williams, Director of Optimal Health Associates. Vitamin D, cholecalciferol, say that three times quickly. So there's two types of vitamin D. There's vitamin D2, which is normally in food, and then you need sunlight to, or parathyroid hormone to activate it into D3. The problem is our food sourcing of D2 is terrible anymore. All of the food sourcing for vitamins is terrible anymore. So you need to supplement uh, uniformly uh, if you're a North American uh, male or female. Now, sometimes African Americans will have a little higher levels, but for the most part, they have also low levels too. So supplementing with vitamin D3, the standard dose for most people is about 5,000 units. If you're somewhere between 120 and 150 pounds, if you're over 150 pounds to 250 pounds, you're probably going to do 10,000. If you're under 120 pounds, you're probably just going to do 5,000 five days a week. You need to take the vitamin D with an oil or a fat, so take it with some milk or ice cream a little, or nuts or something, because vitamin D is a fat-soluble vitamin, ADK, um, are all fat soluble vitamins they need some fat to be absorbed into your system what does vitamin d do well it's documented to be in 2,000 different metabolic pathways in our body it's an immune modulator it helps your immune system it's an anti-cancer it's an anti-neoplastic for ovarian breast uh, pancreatic liver um, cancers uh, trend toward that with prostate it's super protective for parkinson's dementia alzheimer's all neurologic disease seizure disorder and then it's super important for vascular protection low vitamin d's levels in older men men over 50 really over 40 doubles your rate for heart attack uh, and especially fatal mi so vitamin d protects you from heart attack stroke um, and all vascular diseases it also incorporates calcium into bone. Calcium adback therapy is meaningless for the vast majority of people. You need vitamin D to get the calcium into the bone. So if you're eating a normal diet and you're taking 5,000 of D or some level around that, you will then get the calcium and the new bone formation. If you don't have vitamin D, you can take enough calcium to uh, make a new skeleton, but it's all going to just go out your urinary tract and give you kidney stones. Or if you're a guy, uh, and you take calcium alone, you're going to, uh, and you should never take calcium if you're a guy, it's gonna give you coronary disease. So vitamin D, super awesome, great, energy, positive mood, antidepressant, joint pain, um, fantastic stuff, strongly recommend. Thanks.